Hey guys, Dark Sonic Reactions here, and we're back with another reaction video. And today we will be watching Elf and Lead episode 11. And in the last episode, we kind of. We don't want flashbacks. Well, not really. I mean, we did get a look at the uh, the scientist guy. I, I guess technically that is a flashback. Uh, but not so much in the Lucy in the new uh, area. More in the Department of the Scientist and Nana. And all the situations that happened there of the Queen Carrier. And more infecting, uh, infecting uh, people with some virus that has a, a better chance of producing these the horned uh, humans and his task of killing them before uh, at the young age before they could do any harm but you know he also his wife also gave birth to a horned child and which made her basically commit suicide dying in the hospital wondering why you don't want to kill our beautiful child you want you wanted it so bad and pretty messed up stuff like man Things got dark, but he was able to save Nana, but not necessarily in the best way. And now she's in pretty dangerous situations, and now you know why. Not uh, she calls him Papa when these are us all experiments. That would be the reason why. Uh, but now Nana and Lucy, both living under the same roof uh, for now, things could get ugly at uh, any moment in time. But who knows? I also know they're awakened some 20, like, six armed beasts. Uh, some, who knows what could happen. Anyways, I say we go ahead and get started. In a three, two, one, and go. All right. We've only got a few episodes left. Uh, things get pretty crazy. I really hope that director guy in charge of that facility just gets destroyed. I want him dead so bad. He's a horrible person for making these experiments happen, trying to, I want to make a better human race. No, the humans are fine. I've said this so many times. The humans aren't, you know, making the progress of a planet slow. It, it's, Earth is doing fine. Well, as fine as it can be. I mean, you know what I mean. It. You don't need to up upgrade or enhance the human race by killing them all off and just having a, a new race, I guess, of horned uh, human with invisible hands that could kill everyone in like a second. I mean, yeah, does that? That's really. I've said it many times, but that's not gonna have better society in any way. I, I I don't think anyway. I just feel like that would make everyone a lot more violent than they already are, which is that's. You know, it's pretty hard to believe. Humanity itself is it's pretty violent at times. At least in recent history. But, uh, yeah. Enough of that. Let's get into this episode. I'm, I'm very interested in seeing what happens. Um, yeah, so she doesn't just kill anything on site. 11 meters, jeez. That's a large range, so don't step foot in here. Probably. Yeah, you can't just let her out into the open. She would just kill anything in sight. Yeah, I don't think that would be physically possible. I don't know how would that work. Oh. She's just gonna walk in there like, hey, how you doing? It's gonna make everything alright. Hmm. Can't stand, huh? Use her hands to walk. Jeez. I mean, so she's really never had any chance to walk. That makes sense. I think they're all going to just get slaughtered. I don't think so. Mm. I think you're about to be absolutely slaughtered. 
Uh, I have a really bad feeling. Yeah, but you know... I guess we'll see what happens. Nope. Threat? What do you have a... Oh! That's some pretty... That's insane. Um, that's, this, there's some very questionable actions that have happened here. That's, what, what are they, where did they put the bomb in the child? Hmm. Ah, I, I see. Ah, uh, this. Jeez. Here it goes. Man, this, this place is so messed up. You're, we're about to see whatever monstrosity. I mean, it is just a, a child, you know? How, how bad? Put into containment. I wonder how this will go. Bandaged and always naked. Always. You walk just fine, surprisingly. Where is that cable going? She's dead. 100% dead. Where does that lead? You know, maybe I... I, I don't want to know. He's out there ready. Let's see how fast human reaction is. Get out of the. She needs some food, man. Very malnourished. Sliced. Yep. Destruction. There she goes. Yeah. And she's already on the move. This is a bad, bad idea. I mean, what did you guys expect was going to happen? This is just... Bad news all over. <laughs> this blew her arm off. Oof. Got it. <laughs> there, move, move, move. Keep her under control. Jeez. Jeez, this is this is so messed up on so many levels. Man. You'll get a brain freeze. Yeah. That happens. What's new up to now? Then she's gonna take the clock apart. She's fixing. Cause the clock's broken. She wants to fix it. They, oh, she's fixing the clock. He keeps saying that this thing, old thing's broken. She's gonna fix it. Oh, that's awesome. Very sweet of her to do. I still understand these chairs. I I need to be up on stilts. 
that's that's just so weird to me. I wouldn't understand. Um, the research partners. They're both they're both meant for research. Oh. Ooh, everyone's doing their part here. Everyone's working hard. All working together. Yes, perfectly fine. He, she's got no place to go. Hmm. Oops. Let's try and fix that more. Oh, she's just alone in the world she's not used to. She's tired of being alone and afraid. You're her friend. Teacher of things. There you go. Don't be afraid. We're everyone's family here, I guess. Take a nice, warm, comfortable bath. There you go. Yes, taking a nice bath. No, oh, that's the best part. A nice, comfortable, warm bath. That's pretty horrible. Yes, hose. Big hose. Mostly blood. She is very nice. She had to even fix the clock. I mean, she could control herself. You don't know. You never know. Anything could happen. Yeah, everyone could live a happy life. Wouldn't it be great? Ooh, soft serve ice cream. Uh, nope, never met her before. Nope, nope, never seen her. Oh, jeez, that's not gonna... <laughs> you put, you had the bomb in her arm. What the heck, dude? Uh... Yeah, I think he's in a, a bit of a other situation. Jeez, he, I mean, he just wanted to save his daughter, his daughter is all, man. She's coming in. Hmm. Oh. Did he get out while he could? A special fight. He's he's like he dodged the bolt. He's getting out of here. Oh, leave any time. Yeah, he's like forget this, dude. Hey, at least you're alive. She just wants a bath. Oh, hello? She was shot in the arm. She just wants a shower. Yeah. She's got some female priorities she needs to take care of. I can understand that. Hey, there you go. Thing is, it's a lot of his business. You could fix it, no problem. Yeah, you can do it. 
uh, there's a few things. Oh. He wants revenge. Yeah. <laughs> oh. He's planning to kill her. Stop this from happening anymore. Hey, you know, you're wearing the jacket now. Sweet. Yeah, you don't have to do much, just do whatever you can. A little, every little bit helps. Oh. Yeah. She's dead. Yeah. Oof. For a very, very long time. She's... D? Oh. Oh. The memories are coming in. That kind of is going to trigger an event in her head. I like her stockings, though. Very nice stripes stocks. Stocks? Socks. They're nice. Whoa, careful there. No, whoa, 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 hey. What are you doing? She's doing bad things out here. New. Oh. Hmm. Oh. Jeez. So sad. I agree. She is really a nice person. Oh, man. Doesn't want it all. This is so sweet. She even cut her hair and everything. Yeah. No, oh, it's that's long over. No, don't cry. No. Oh. So it's gonna trigger things in her head. So it's all right. You have for quite a long time, actually. Ooh, <laughs> dang. Oh, man. Now she's really sad. But, you know, you're also like cousins, so, you know, it's a little weird. It's a little weird. Just saying. Understandable. She really just wants to fix that clock, you know? Don't worry, she's gonna fix it. That's, uh... That's, I think, way too much food. Yeah, he's a nice little doggy. <laughs> Just a dog. Yeah, he's very nice. She's here. She can sense. Uh oh, she's. I would be worried. They're here, but this one is very bad. Jeez. Uh oh, she's gonna open up a file right to his face, isn't she? Of course, right? Oh, what are the chances? That's really bad. This is bad. Gotta get out of here before it's too late. Mm -hmm. 
she was. Oh, you just check right outside your place. There should be a bag sitting there. I think she's very upset. She has, she has not have much time left. She must go before she gets you all endangered. She must. Yeah, she wants some soma noodles. Um, uh, that's she doesn't want to have everyone here die. She doesn't want to have that happen to anyone after the kindness she's received. Oh, man. And she's just... Uh, he... You just had a large kiss session. Uh, um, in the rain. Well, y you know. I mean, she's also... He's also, like... Your cousin? That's a little weird. Dang, we got a big operation going on. Yeah? Let me tell you, it's a bad... It, it's not good. They're on their way. Things are getting ugly. And they're making it quite public. Yeah, it's no ordinary VIP. This is, uh... A dangerous thing that would really actually kill like all of humanity, given the, the chance. Jeez. If you do anything crazy. Oh. She wants to face it head on. Oh man. That's gonna be crazy. Yes, she does. Tell us the info. But you know what's about that. As one does normally. Oh, she didn't want to have any problems. Man. Kota? He's uh, going out. I don't know if there's, there's much you can do. You, you're crazy, man. You two, wh wh what can you do? You just, I mean, uh, good luck out there, buddy. I don't know what you can do. She is coming no matter what. Protect you and your life with everything she has. He's gone. He's got a death wish. Yeah, something big. It's a big. Something big's going down. Hey, there you go. But there's not much time left. The beach. Uh-oh. Yeah, I think he knows where to go now. Uh, this is going to be a pretty intense fight. Right, go, you're going right into it, huh? But don't ruin the jacket, it's so nice. No. Yep. They don't get too close. Yeah. You just have to get... Well... Man, rip... Well... Yeah, she's got all her parts flying all over. At least she's got one leg still attached. Uh, I I don't 
even begin to know how they're gonna stop uh this monster. I mean, this really is like an, an abomination of how how much is in uh, this girl number thirty five, right? There's, there's so much uh, killing intense. I mean, without restriction, she would uh, kill any and everything in front of her face. For five years, she talked to a woman and called her mom, but it was all a facade. Just killed her straight away. Which, of course, I knew that would happen. Who who wouldn't knew that was going to happen to her? I mean, that was just perfect. It's like, oh, everything's just fine. I, she's called me mom and everything. No, you're, you're a dead woman. If you thought that was ever going to work. I mean... They implanted multiple bombs inside her. That just seems... We did put bombs inside an infant and have them... I mean... I mean, those had to be relatively small bombs put inside an infant, right? I mean, I guess it's still effective, but how would the, the human body and skeleton grow around said bombs inside? It's just, there's a lot of questions to be asked there, and... Well, I don't really need an answer. It's just pretty weird. But, okay. I think he's going to be remembering some things of the past. It's going to be a intense fight. How will they be able to handle this? I'm pretty sure that was his sister there. Episode 12. Quagmire? Ooh. That's not, a, uh, not an often used. Isn't that like a like a type of cave or, or something along the? I could be wrong, but I thought that's what it was like a, a cave of some sort, like a large crack in the ground. I could be wrong, but I thought that's what that was. But anyways, that was the Elfin Lead episode eleven, and yeah, things are gonna get very intense. Next episode, some fighting, some memories coming up that uh, that have been forgotten for a long time. I don't know how they'll stop her. Um, hopefully, the guy, uh, the little scientist, has fixed the guy's arm. Maybe he'll be able to come into handy. I I don't know, but uh, I guess we'll see what happens. It's gonna be quite the wild ride. Uh, not much else to say other than that, but you guys. Uh, have enjoyed, and hope to see you guys again on next time.